Welcome to the Intuit QuickBooks Enterprise Solutions Introduction and Demonstration. What we'd like to do today is first tell you a little bit about you and us, and by us we mean Intuit and QuickBooks Enterprise. Then we'll talk about the new features in QuickBooks Enterprise Solutions 12.0. Then we'll get into the product demonstration portion of our meeting, and then after that I'll explain some next steps. So first a little bit about you. We know that there are two groups that consider the purchase of QuickBooks Enterprise. The first group are those that are pushing the limits of their current Pro or Premier software. They're typically looking for enhanced reporting and customization. Some are looking for more sophisticated inventory tools. Some are looking for additional users or advanced user controls. Some are looking for more list capacity to track their inventory items or names and some are looking for a better performing product. Then there's the group that are considering switching from another accounting solution and they are typically looking for a low or lower total cost of ownership. Some are looking for a product that's easy to learn and easy to use. Some are looking for a more modern or reliable system. Some are looking for real-time access to data, reports, and analytics. And lastly, some are looking for some help migrating their existing data onto the new software platform. Next, a little bit about us. QuickBooks is the best-selling accounting software for small and mid-sized businesses. Enterprise Solutions is the most advanced QuickBooks product, currently selected by over 100,000 businesses, some of them just like yours. We're also PCMag.com's editor's choice for mid-level accounting software. Next we'll talk about some of the new features in Enterprise Solutions 12.0. Enterprise Solutions 12.0 has the advanced functionality to meet more complex business needs. Customers just like you asked us for features that can help them make better decisions and drive efficiency. Enterprise Solutions 12.0 is a direct result of that feedback. With QuickBooks Enterprise, you can manage and measure inventory with greater efficiency. We've added a new inventory center that allows you to easily access important inventory items and reports all in one place. We've added a feature called Enhanced Inventory Receiving. This will allow you to keep item receipts and bills as separate transactions. And we've given you the ability to change assembly components and their quantities on the fly. And that's for those of you that are doing manufacturing in QuickBooks. We've improved the advanced inventory functionality in QuickBooks Enterprise, so now you can get even more inventory functionality with this add-on subscription. With advanced inventory, you can track inventory in multiple locations. You can now track serial numbers or lot numbers right in the program. And in addition to average costing, we've now given you a choice to switch to FIFO costing. You can get a comprehensive view of your business with our enhanced reporting and customization. We've added functionality that will allow you to save spreadsheet formatting when you export reports to Excel. We have new built-in and combined reports. We've given you the ability to create custom reports with ODBC compliant applications by connecting them directly to your QuickBooks Enterprise database. And we allow you to create professional financial statements with the Intuit Statement Writer. Enterprise Solutions allows you to be more productive and do more in less time. Now in QuickBooks Enterprise Solutions, you can work in two company files at the same time. With the new automatic price markup feature, you can choose whether to have QuickBooks change any sales price automatically when the cost of your items change. 
In QuickBooks Enterprise, you can use multi-user mode to adjust inventory, define custom fields, and make deposits. And QuickBooks Enterprise is the only version of our software that's designed to allow multiple users to work remotely using Microsoft Remote Desktop Services. You can keep your confidential data secure with flexible user controls. In QuickBooks Enterprise, you can restrict user access to over 115 different areas and activities. There's also an always-on audit trail that records everything that happens transaction-wise in QuickBooks. Enterprise Solutions has a scalability to meet your company's unique needs. With QuickBooks Enterprise, you can scale from 5 all the way up to 30 simultaneous users. You can also track up to 1 million names and inventory items. Next we'll talk about some of the new features in Enterprise Solutions 12.0. First we've added a new calendar view. This will give you an easy way to see important transactions, when they're due, or any tasks that need to be done. We've improved the document center which will allow you to attach any sort of electronic or scanned documents to any of your QuickBooks records. We've added a Lead Center. The Lead Center is a feature that will allow QuickBooks users to manage their prospects and leads in QuickBooks before they become customers. We've added functionality to the Memorize Transactions feature. This will allow you to review individual transactions and select which ones you want to run and which ones you'd like to postpone. We made it significantly easier to find and enter items into sales forms by allowing you to search for information in any field, including custom fields. This feature is available on invoices, sales receipts, and sales orders. And with your purchase of QuickBooks Enterprise, you'll get exclusive access to our team of U.S.-based product experts. And that comes as part of your full service plan. So with that, we'll get into the product demonstration portion of our meeting. What you're looking at now is the QuickBooks home screen. The home screen is divided up into what I feel are logical sections. First, there's the vendor section for accounts payable activities. Then you have the customer section for accounts receivable activities. Then you have the employee section for payroll functions. The banking section where you'll enter credit card charges, write checks, make deposits, and reconcile your accounts. And then the company section, well, you'll enter your items and services and chart of accounts. Now, when you first create your QuickBooks data file, you'll go through what's called the Easy Step Interview. And the Easy Step Interview will ask you a few short questions about your business. That will determine the icons that you see here on the home screen. Now, after you've gone through the Easy Step Interview, we allow you to easily change those preferences if you need to. Here's where you'll tell the program whether you track inventory and use purchase orders. This is where you'll tell the program whether you create estimates or do progress invoicing. And here's where you'll tell the program whether you use price levels or use sales orders. So as you can see we make it very easy to change those preferences at any time. You'll also notice on the home screen that there's a workflow diagram that's been mapped out for you. And what that's really showing you is how one form relates to another. So we'll take a look at an estimate as an example and you'll notice that there's arrows pointing up to the create sales orders icon and there's an arrow pointing to the Create Invoices icon. And we'll take a look at an estimate that's been uh, filled out here. But what that is showing you is with just one click, you could create an invoice 
from this estimate. With just a couple of clicks, you could create a sales order from this estimate if you needed to track back orders or create some sort of internal work order. You could also create a purchase order from this estimate if you needed to order product from a vendor or work from a subcontractor. All right, so now we're going to go through a list of features in QuickBooks Enterprise, and we're going to start with some scalability features that are designed to give you some flexibility and room to grow. We'll cover some of the list features in QuickBooks, and we're going to start with the items list. The items list in QuickBooks is where you will create all of your service items, Inventoried parts, if you need to track a quantity. Inventory assemblies, if you do any sort of manufacturing. Non-inventoried parts. You can create other charge items for labor or any sort of service or delivery charge. You can create subtotal items and subtotal items together on forms. You can create group items, which are sort of like kits. You can create discount payment items, and then you have your sales tax items and sales tax groups. So all of those are items that belong on your items list. Now, in our Pro and Premier software, this items list is limited to 14,500 total items. In QuickBooks Enterprise, we have greatly increased that to a million. So you can have a million items on your items list in QuickBooks Enterprise. Now we've also increased the number of custom fields that you can add to your items in QuickBooks Enterprise. And in our Pro and Premier software, you are limited to five custom fields. In QuickBooks Enterprise, we have increased that to 15. So you can have 15 custom fields in QuickBooks Enterprise. We've also given you the ability to dictate what sort of information can go into those custom fields, including the ability to create a multiple choice list so that a user gets a drop down similar to this where they just choose a value. And we've given you the ability to require the use on certain transactions or lists. And that is unique to QuickBooks Enterprise.